My name is Wilbert Rollins, Jr. Uh, I am the director of bands here at Landry High School. Uh, because of COVID, we haven't been able to have practice. We haven't been able to develop the younger musicians. If you think about it, two years ago, uh, the freshmen were freshmen. ninth graders. Then you have two years in between that. So now the freshmen are juniors, you know. So they haven't acquired those skills of leadership and constant and continuous practicing and developing themselves as instrumentalists, you know. So it's really rough, but Mardi Gras season is what it is, you know. The expectations are high, so we just have to do the best we can and work hard, you know. Yeah. Kids are always excited about parade season just because of what it, what it does, you know. I call it the it. It's the wow factor. It's the, it's the moment in life where you can achieve what it is that, you know, every day we all wake up trying to achieve what's called self-gratification. And when you have thousands and thousands upon thousands of people clapping and cheering and profusely clapping their hands together, you can as an artist. You know, it's, that's the wow factor. So that's what you look forward to, you know, as a musician. You know. we, we take parade season a little different here. You know, bands all come from the military. So we come up the street, it's a, it's a battalion, you know. It's a battalion of individuals. We're all going to be on the same foot uh, with the same mindset. This is not a fun for us. This is a job. This is work. You know, those five miles are going to be five miles for real. As I just marched the Rose Bowl parade, I, I have a newfound respect for the marcher. You know, as a director, I used to walk and wave my hands and speak to everyone. But as a marcher in that parade, I realized that the strenuous nature of what it is that we do. You know, sometimes you, I got really tired in that parade at Rose Bowl, but um, you just have to keep on pushing on <clears throat> because I can teach those core values to a child that sometimes life gets a little hard, you know, life skills. Life gets a little hard sometimes. You can't quit. You can't give up. Your parents don't quit and give up, you know. And then you realize that when you thought you were tired and you couldn't go anymore, then maybe here comes the bridge or here comes an area where you know your parents are. And now all of a sudden you have what's called a second wind. After you do this a couple of times, it transfers directly over into life, you know. So I, I'm, I'm really looking forward to parade season. Like I said, I, um, we have brand new uniforms, brand new instruments. I mean, the children are excited. I'm excited. I'm just happy to be back out there in the streets of New Orleans. In, in the band world, if I take a kid and I start to train him how to read music, I am going to develop his brain faster than any other discipline in the world. I'm going to teach him focus, concentration. I'm going to develop the right side of his brain, which is the creative side of the brain. And this is how we start to turn on all of the portals in a child's brain. So at an age of seven, eight, nine years old, if I can get you to develop these skills, then this is how we're probably going to create the next generation of individuals who are going to create the, the cure for cancer, the, the, the cure for HIV, the cure for COVID. So we won't have to go through what we just went through. You know, these children are going to have to be developed in the brain to be creative, think outside of the box. Not to mention the fact that when you're at band practice, band practice is directly after school, which means that you're going to be in an environment that's conducive for teaching and learning. You know, you're going to be governed by someone who, um, it's sort of like, I, I, I look at this band room as like my pulpit, you know. I, I, I'm going to infuse within you life skills. I'm going to give you a life skills. I'm going to make it to where as you understand how band relates to life, period, you know. So we have to continue to, to support these extracurricular activities.